I thought it was recording. There's these little kids in front of my house. But they keep cussing in the funniest ways. But I have two pairs of these left. Um, these are a pair of earrings that I made. Um, but I decided to make these mine. So I stole these. I gotta take them off of Depop. But I thought these matched my shirt. So. little girl just goes, go to hell. <laughs> I want to go to hell with you. I think my second earring closed. Oh. Uh. Have you ever had to re-pierce your own ear? There we go. I think that's too much. Yeah. That <laughs> hurts. This earring is too big. <laughs> oh, Ew, it's not working. <laughs> it's like, let me at least make sure this one's not all the way closed. Nope. We're still Gucci, this hurts. <laughs> okay, so anyway. I think I'm gonna take this off for this look.
So these are the colors. It's like I don't want to talk loud because I don't want to disrupt their playtime. So I really liked the look of like a light pink base. So I'm gonna try that again today. I'm gonna use two kin mango, two to mango. Go Humpty Dumpty style. <laughs> <laughs> this is better than music any day. And it's funny because I hear an adult and these kids are just cussing up a storm. It's so funny. <laughs> your, your girlfriend is dead, bro. <laughs> like, what the heck? <laughs> now I'm going to take Brody. I don't know what I want to do with my colors. 
because you guys are getting tired of me doing the same looks. So... We'll see what we can do. I know, I know I did a cut crease in my last video, but something tells me it'd be pretty to try to do one with this blue right here. Yeah, so I think I'm going to try the light blue. I'm trying to do new things and... And excite you guys. So I just used foundation to do a little base. Uh, I've been using foundation as opposed to concealer because I just feel like it's a little bit more natural. Um, I know it might, it might not make the colors pop as crazy crazy, but I don't know why. I don't know why. I've just been doing that. So I'm going to take baseline. And just a little brush that looks like this. And if you have hooded eyes, make sure you don't open them. Or your concealer is going to get up on like your other part. And uh, we don't want that. I tried to do the look where you kind of open your eyes and do the concealer bigger if you have hooded eyes. But I don't know why. Sometimes I just... I don't like doing that. So we're going to just take a little tiny brush like this. This is from Vanity Planet. I don't even know if they have that collection anymore. But um, I'm just going to put a decent amount on here just to make sure my little brush is covered in some color. And then I'm just going to start applying it and see what we get. Oops. 
it's pretty. So let's see. The children outside were told they had to go home, so. No more entertainment. <laughs> So far this is looking like a pretty pastel look. <laughs> I like the bright colors, so I'm worried that if I try to go in with this dark blue, I'm, I'm scared I will just look like a, uh, a goofball. I don't know. <laughs> so this color is backstage. I guess it's not more of, it's not really a navy blue as opposed to like an electric blue. Definitely looked like a navy blue in the package, but, uh, I don't. So, fingers crossed, um, I'm going to be quiet now, again. I don't know what to do. <laughs> so that brush is a little bit dense uh, I'm going to go in with this little guy and it's just a little bit more fluffy it's not as packed compact uh, if that makes sense um, in person this looks cool it looks like a piece of art right on camera it looks like something else so I, <laughs> I don't know what to do because I also don't want this blue to like blend in with the color of my pupil and make it like look like I'm a creature or something. So I'm going to pat in really lightly and just kind of like blend that out a little bit, I guess. I guess it kind of looks cool because it's still like blending into my crease. I haven't made it above my crease yet. <laughs> what is she saying? We don't know. It it makes sense somewhere in her mind. So I'm gonna go back in with the fluffy brush that I used to uh, put my orange down. And a part of me is actually telling me that I should go in with just a slight bit of orange on my brush and just pat that down a little bit. Welcome to class with Sarah. We never know what we're going to do. But that's the joy of life, not having a plan. Am I right? I'm right. I know I am. I don't know how I, how I like this anymore. I knew I should not have added that flippin' blue. Shoulda, woulda, coulda, but you did. But you did. Alright, so we're gonna go in with a clean brush. I said that last time, alright? I said that this is... Oh, man... Okay, so I'm 
Alright. We're gonna make this work. This is what happens when I try to step outside my comfort zone. Oh my god. So now we're mixing together those two <laughs> colors with a little bit of this. Oh, goodness. I mean, it's giving it like a cool hue if you look at it with your eyes closed, but if you look at it with your eyes open... <laughs> Looks like somebody tried to cover up a dark spot on the wall. Something's telling me to grab a red. I just want to grab a red so bad. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna find a red. I need home base. Where is home base? Okay, so I'm gonna go in with this color right here. It's more so like a fuchsia pink. There she is. Right there. That little dingleberry. And <laughs> I'm gonna go in with This brush that we used for the blue, right? We're gonna wipe that off. I have this like color swatch thing that you can just like do that and your brush is decently cleaner. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with that pinkish color. I'm just going to try to dab that ever so slightly, kind of on this area, because I don't like the way that looks at all. So we're just going to try to kind of dab over that with red. This will make sense, alright? It will make sense. Okay, not bad. I'm going to pat over that with this orange and the bigger brush just to kind of try to blend those two together a little bit more. Somebody's like, dude, this isn't working. And I'm like, I know, trust me. I, I know. Okay, so I know this is going to sound absolutely crazy, but I want to try to put this color now right in between the blue and that weird mess we got going on. So I'm just going to real quickly go over the blue one more time to make sure they're still vibing with this. And, yeah. To make sure they're still wanting to hang out. We can't lose our baby blue. Alright, so here comes the grand finale. Alright? The grand finale. I'm going to take the color La Playa. I told you. Player. Um, and... They look like this. Beautiful color. And I'm going to take it.
And I'm going to get the brush a little wet, just a little. Pack it on there nice, nicely. And I'm gonna place that right here. Okay, so now that we have that done, we are going to go in, goodness, so I'm going to go in with the brush I told you was too dense, and I'm going to use, let me wipe it off first, some, some brown, alright, we're going to use We're just going to go in with this brown right here. And I'm just going to tap my brush onto that, tap off the brush, tap it in, tap off the brush. And I'm going to put this towards the outer corner. And then just to darken that up a little, little bit more, I'm going to take this color right here. And again, I'm just gonna tap it in. That. And then lastly, I'm going to take the orange once again. And same concept, I'm just going to tap it a little bit and then pat it down. Wow. I don't think she needs eyeliner. I, I don't. I mean, I want some, but. I am just going to go in with fake eyelashes. I still have these guys, so. I'm going to cut these up Alright, so the eyelashes are as good as it's going to get. I'm not sure, I'm not sure how I'm feeling the lashes, but I think once I add mascara, <laughs> that will help a lot. So, I'm just not going to give up. Uh, I'm going to... 
going to add some white into my waterline just to make this look pop more than it already needs to. Okay, as my eyes settle from that, let's move on to our face. Okay, so just because I know that my card is full, my camera's about to die, and you guys see me do my foundation every single video, I'm going to quickly fast forward through this and uh, show the final look because I, <laughs> I still want to show how the eye look turned out with the way the face makeup looks. So I'm going to be right back. I'm going to finish up some of this, and then, yes, we will see what we have. I'm sorry. <clears throat> so I finished... The look, I wanted to try to keep it really light. Ow! I tried to keep my contour really subtle so the focus is more so on the eyes. But this is the final and finished look. I think I like the hair tucked behind the ears better. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this journey. <laughs> but yeah. I just tried to do a little braid. I thought it looked pretty. I hope that your weekend is calm, cool, and collected. And yeah. I, uh... Don't forget to drink plenty of water. And to get some books read. Why don't you read some books? I need to make a new video recommending some books. You guys have asked where the heck my book videos are. 